हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू एकेडमिक ड्रीम चैनल एकेडमिक ड्रीम चैनल इज ए क्लासरूम फॉर बीएड कोर्स इन द कंटिन्यूएशन ऑफ आवर डिस्कशन टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक फ्रॉम द पेपर फाउंडेशन ऑफ करिकुलम डेवलपमेंट ऑन नॉलेज एंड करिकुलम सो इन दिस पेपर इन नॉलेज एंड करिकुलम और फाउंडेशन ऑफ करिकुलम डेवलपमेंट In this paper, we are continuously discussing a number of points, a number of uh, sub points of syllabus guided by NCT. So today we have taken a very important topic. Topic is actually directly not mentioned in the syllabus, but indirectly, it is one of the part of syllabus. The topic is taken in the form of question. The question is asked a number of times in different universities. The question is taken in the form of, uh, I mean to say the topic is taken in the form of question. Question is again a quotation. This question is again a quotation. The quotation is, Curriculum is all of the learning of students which is planned and directed by the school to attain its educational goals. Let us see this question once again. Curriculum is all of the learning. Curriculum is all of the learning of students which is planned and directed by the school to attain its educational goals elucidated. We must explain it, what the quotation means. So this kind of question, this question in relation to the quotation is common character of question of B.A.D. level. So this, to answer this kind of question, any root memorization will not help. It needs understanding. To, under, to answer any question related to quotation, we will need our deep understanding on the subject. Here it is very simple. The quotation is very simple. Curriculum is all of the learning of students. That means what is learned by the student, that is curriculum. So what is, which is planned and directed by the school? Curriculum means which the student learn and their learning syllabus and materials are planned and directed by the school. School or the board or the authority plan plan, prepare the scheme and direct it to learn by student school to attain. Why? To attain is educational goal. So we have educational goal and we must, we must understand what is our goal and according to the goal, the school prepare and direct some content, syllabus and learning material which the student should learn. That is a quotation. On the basis of this quotation, we must, we must explain what is the meaning of the question. And that must be elucidated. Actually, the quotation was given by the quotation was given by R A L P H Ref Tiger T Y L E R Tyler or Tyler Tyler Ref Tyler in 1957. In 1957, 
this quotation was given by Ralph Tyler. And on the basis of this quotation, we must answer it. So, ultimately, the quotation means there is a relation between curriculum and goals of education. Because the school plan and direct the learning materials to attain educational goals. So, to sum up, the quotation give importance on the relation of goals and curriculum, relation between educational goals and curriculum. So, what is the relation between educational goals and curriculum? This is, these six points will reflect the relation between goals and curriculum. This is, these six points indicate relation between educational goals and curriculum. Actually, these six points means relation between education well, educational goals relation between educational goals and curriculum G O A L S goals relation between educational goals G O L goals and curriculum relation between educational goals and curriculum these six points reflect only on that point and that is the main theme of the quotation that should be elucidated now number one point goals guide the nature of content what should be the content of the curriculum. What should be the content of curriculum of class 5? And on the basis of that content, to prepare that content, we must think what is our goal of education in that particular level. Number two, goals are foundation of curriculum. We cannot prepare the curriculum haphazardly according to our wish. Scholar, the curriculum committee, curriculum setter cannot prepare curriculum according to their own wish. What is the base of curriculum? The foundation of curriculum is goal. What is the goal of education in a particular level? What is the goal of education? of class 10 in general education. So, according to that, the content should be selected. Goals lead to cognitive aspect of curriculum. So, cognitive means mental. We have three aspect in our life. One is cognitive, that is mental. Curriculum must ensure mental development. So another is effective and another is our physical. So goals lead to cognitive aspect of curriculum. That means the aim of education of school is to ensure intellectual development of the learners and intellect for that content should be selected. So that is goals lead to cognitive aspect of life. Next, goals leads to effective aspect of curriculum. In our curriculum, such content should be available which develop our feeling and understanding. So feeling and understanding is a part of our life. That is again related to cognitive development. So, which type of content will develop our effective aspect 
that content should be selected and as one of the goal is effective development of children so curriculum should include those content which develop our effective area that means feeling and understanding goals lead to psychomotor development psychomotor development is our physical movement physical work physical activity so physical movement physical development physical activity should be developed among children the nature of physical activity nature of psychomotor development is different from pre primary level to primary level primary level to secondary level on the basis of that for which level we are going to prepare curriculum that should be recognized first of all then we must recognize what will be the goal if the goal is psychomotor development then curriculum should include those content those physical activity those project those subject matter which will ensure psychomotor development that is why co curricular activities like games sports yoga education these all are part of curriculum nowadays goals e goal is one of the principle of curriculum development the curriculum setter should follow certain principle of curriculum development there are a number of principle of curriculum development which the experts should follow so one of the principle is goal one of the principle is principle of aim or goal so first of all we must decide the goal and goal will lead to the selection of the content in the curriculum if our goal is to development of different skill in computer then we must select those content in the curriculum in this subject so that it really develop the practical skill if our goal is to prepare the children to prepare the children to make powerpoint in computer so we must include this part of content content of this part and practical work so that children will learn and children will be expert in doing powerpoint so goal is one of the principle of curriculum development in this way red tailor provided us a very good quotation that quotation itself is a question in this quotation there are a number of important concept are there the important concept is nothing the quotation actually pointed relation between educational goal and curriculum and how goals are fundamental to develop curriculum that is the ultimate thing of this quotation so dear trainees dear learners as we have learned briefly about all about this quotation so this is elucidated elucidation means explain it and we can explain the quotation by the, the help of all these points so i think so we have understood better today we have to learn the ins and out this of uh, this quotation we will learn in our next video the number of concept in this paper till then thank you